your fan base has immediate access yeah, to you yeah, guys it's digital. now. It's digital. Digital, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So so with having a fan base that you guys have, like a cult fan base, and you are able to put music out digitally now, how does that change the game for y'all? Just made I mean, it not not so much. I mean, because you know that that publishing, mm-hmm. you know. <laughs> I yeah. mean, you know, if yeah. you uh if you know, if you are um, fortunate enough to have written any of uh, the music, um, you know, it's, it's not so bad. Not so bad. <laughs> I mean, I the good you. thing with us, too, is that, you know, this Nokia, um, the good thing with us is that, you know, a lot of the younger generation, you know, their aunts and uncles and, right. you know, brothers and sisters, you know, were they playing pa- our music. They passed it along. You know, so they grew up, you know, with us. So, you know, we've been able to, you know, see multi-generational, you mm-hmm. know, fans come and, you know, just let them use sample our music, right? Like, I mean, <laughs> repeatedly. Now that no, they now a couple couple artists and sample it. Everybody yeah. hair blowing now. It's like, <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. Man, I just want to say something to the artists that may be watching this right now, man. If you watch these guys do this interview, you can see the polish. Every time they jump on the mic and they pass between each other, they say their names before <laughs> they talk. I mean, you can't that's teach that, that type that, of stuff that's nowadays. That's the, that's the artist, question that's the and the answer. I mean, right? yeah, that's, that's, right. that's that time you know spent really. You know, making sure that, you know, you're going to be around and not, you know, here today and gone tomorrow. Right. Mm-hmm. You guys have some time in the game. When was the first, when was the first one dropped? 96? 96. 96. Yep. Straight out of high school. 22 years later, y'all still here. <laughs> and mm-hmm. still relevant. Because I was Man. playing y'all's music the other day. I had a little date. You know what I'm hey, saying? Hey, let me find mm-hmm. out. <laughs> it still works. <laughs> hey, man, I got to give a shout out to my guy, Blasworth, uh, the, one of the media guys up here. He was like, Cisco changed my life when he ran across the chicks. <laughs> 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 he said, I thought I could run the world at that, at that moment. <laughs> hilarious. Because the label said that part was unnecessary. See? <laughs> <laughs> See? They one of the one of the biggest parts in the video. You knew what to do. <laughs> hey man, you guys uh now tell me about the new music. The new music is coming out. Dude. Man, it's 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 Nokia again. It's, he just lit up. He just Cisco lit up and dropped back. All right, talk to me, man. <laughs> no, I mean we just, you know, we're really excited for, you know, people to hear it. Mm-hmm. You know, like a lot of times, you know, artists that are around as long as us, you know, people always when you gonna make some new music? When you mm-hmm. gonna make some new music? And, you know, we just wanted to make sure that you know, we were able to make something that, you know, incorporates a little bit of the day, but not mm-hmm. becoming what's going on, but making sure that we stuck to the foundation of what right. we do, which, you know, the love songs, the harmonies, mm-hmm. you know, and everything that you love about us. So, and a couple of surprises. Okay. Yeah. We, I uh, can't, I'm, I'm going to ask when the camera cuts off. I'm not uh, going to tell. So, y'all let uh, me know uh, something. Uh, absolutely. Man. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. We'll, 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 we'll put you down with what's popping. That's what's up. Um, yeah, man. But uh, we was uh, we were just in the studio last night recording. Um, mm. In Atlanta? Uh, were y'all in Atlanta? Record? Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, you never recording. know who that is. Everybody comes through here. So, yeah, you never well, know. We've uh, been recording with um, uh, Troy Taylor, mm. producer um, who's worked with like everybody. Everybody, Everybody, right? Right. Trey Google songs, them. Boys right. Men. Right. We he actually do, produced yeah. the um the the Christmas album also. Mm-hmm. Okay. So All right. you know. that's what's up, man. Drew Hill is right here with your boy Reese. Now social media has just branched off like crazy. I see y'all are real active. We got the Drew Hill page and everything. Uh, how has that changed the game for y'all? The social media though. Dude, I if our man Don right there, if he don't be taking pictures, y'all ain't never see me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, uh, Tretch said the same thing when I interviewed Naughty by Nature. They was like, man, we got a, a guy that like you know shoots his shots, make mm-hmm. sure everything gets up. Mm-hmm. But I know y'all's DMs are crazy though. Oh, I man. know that's crazy. To... <laughs> I ain't gonna try. I ain't getting nobody in trouble. He's talking about the DMs, Jim. Yeah. It's a smoke. I don't even go to the DM. No more. He don't even go no more. The DMs come to you. The I'm not as fortunate. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? 